water in a canal 30 decimeter wide and 12 decimeter deep is flowing with velocity of 10 km per hour. How much area will it irrigate in 30 minutes if 8 centimeters of standing water is required? Now see here, water in a canal, so here breadth height is given and this when they will say velocity or speed 10 km per hour, this 10 km will be the length because in that length, see here, it's a cuboid. Canal will take in the shape of a cuboid. Here clearly they told the breadth is 30 decimeter, height is 12 decimeter and length is the speed whenever they will tell that will be the length of the canal. Here length is 10 kilometers per hour. So here the time is like 1 hour in 1 hour time. In 1 hour it will cover like 10 kilometers. Now this water from this canal the water is flowing on the ground like area how much area will it irrigate in 30 minutes so this volume and this volume will be like same like because the same water flows but they are asking in 30 minutes so here it is 1 hour 1 hour I will write as 60 minutes here the same water is flowing here so here we need to find L into B because they are asking area we need to find area this is also I will take the shape of a cuboid because ground when the water is standing on the ground we will take it as in the shape of a cuboid so here L into B I need to find height is given 8 centimeters so whenever a water is flowing from one place to another place see I will tell the easy method like just do volume by time equals volume by time because both are like same same volume flows on the ground so how much area will it cover means so both the volumes will be same so here I am taking it as cuboid so I will write L into B into H by time equals here also L into B into H by time here I need to find how much area so I need to find L into B now if you will observe the units here it is centimeter kilometer decimeter decimeter so decimeter is nothing but one tenth of a meter 30 by 10 meters this is 12 by 10 meters this is 10 into 1000 meters so this 3 I change in terms of meters and now see here if you calculate this height height also if you want to write in terms of meter height is nothing but 8 by 100 meters because 1 meter is 100 centimeter so 1 by 100 meter is 1 centimeter so centimeter also I am writing in terms of meter now all the values if you will substitute here you will get directly the value of area now see L is here 30 by 10 meters so I will write 30 by 10 into breadth is 12 by 10 height is 10 into 1000 by time time is here 60 minutes and here L into B which is nothing but area height is 8 by 100 time is 30 time is 30 minutes because here it is in 60 minutes here 30 minutes now directly you will get the value of A just transpose this one now see 30 into 12 into 10 into 1000 after transposing you cancel it will be easy 10 into 10 into 60 into 100 into 30 these two values are transpose here denominator this 8 if I transpose it will come to the denominator that is nothing but area now slowly you cancel these values 0 0 0 0 12 times 1 oh sorry 2 times 6 2 times 3 3 times 1 3 times 10 2 times 3 2 times 4 4 ones 4 25 10 10 so area equals now here see you are left with 3 into 3 into 1000 into 25 so area equals 
थ्री टाइम्स थ्री इज नाइन नाइन इंटू ट्वेंटी फाइव नाइन टाइम्स ट्वेंटी फाइव इज टू ट्वेंटी फाइव इंटू थाउजेंड सो टू ट्वेंटी फाइव सो टू लैक्स ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड मीटर स्क्वेर दिस मच एरिया इट विल कवर इन हाफ एन आवर वेन वाटर इज फ्लोइंग सो सी जस्ट राइट द वैल्यूज बोथ द वॉट एवर लाइक सपोज सम क्वेश्चन विल कम लाइक सिलेंडर एंड सिलेंडर आर समाइम्स क्यूबाइड एंड सिलेंडर सो जस्ट डू वॉल्यूम ऑफ दिस वॉट एवर इज अ सॉलिड बाई टाइम taken equals volume by time taken because both this water only will flow on the other solid so volume and time both if you just equate you'll get the answer so here the area is 2 lakh 25000 meters square and this is one of the most important question because in cbse 2014 and as well as 2019 they asked this.